sudden death of a high school football player is shaking a local school. This is the young man. In the last 45 minutes, we got this picture of the freshman. And Channel 2's Richard Elliott live at Creekside High School in South Fulton County. Richard, students talked to some grief counselors today as it's been a heavy time. It has been indeed. It's uh, great grief counselors were here to help students. Once they learned of the death of ninth grader Kamari McGowan, he was on the football field yesterday when school officials say coaches noticed he wasn't looking good. This is a photo of Kamari McGowan from a Facebook page. Two of his classmates at Creekside High School confirmed it. They're all in mourning, school officials say, after McGowan got sick during football conditioning and later died. Teddy Simon's son was on the football field but didn't see any of this happen when he picked him up after drills. But when I got here, they were sending the bleachers on the front, so I just rode around and picked him up, but he never said anything about it. In fact, parents didn't know any details until Simon says they got a text from Creekside officials. We received news about it this morning. And they said something happened. So when I came up to the school for the field day, I asked my son, did he hear anything about it? He was like, no. According to the school district, a coach noticed McGowan looking pale during conditioning and pulled him off the field. Later, they say they called 911 and paramedics took him to the hospital where he later died. In a statement, school officials said they were, quote, saddened by the heartbreaking news of the death of Kamari McGowan. The cause of death has not been confirmed. Our thoughts and prayers are with the McGowan family. The district also says it's launched an investigation into McGowan's death. Teddy Simons knows it's awful hot out there on the football field. He hopes officials are looking after their kids. I mean, it was it was surprising, out of concern for the kids and their well-being when they when we're not in their presence. You know, just to make sure that they properly being conditioned out on the field. So. Again, there are no indications as to why Kamari McGowan passed away. School officials believe an investigation will be able to make that determination. We are live in South Fulton County, Richard Elliott, Channel Two Action News.